Hello YouTube, Adventures in Metals back. What I got here is five graphics cards that I got from an IT friend who uh, comes into possession of a bunch of things and uh, he was looking to get rid of some stuff. He actually ended up uh, changing out my entire PC, which was very kind of him. I came over to his house to get a, uh, a fan replaced on the CPU of my computer and he was just like, well, I don't have one that fits, so why don't we just change out the whole motherboard? And he actually ended up putting in a new graphics card too. So I ended up with a pretty much a near new computer, but he was looking to get rid of some stuff. I got all that down here, all, all those motherboards and these graphics cards. So I've never uh, scrapped the graphics card. So what, usually what I do is I'll look on YouTube to see what to look for and I couldn't find anything specifically about these kind of graphics cards. I found one video, I think, and it didn't really show what was in it uh, from just based off memory. So I figured, why not just make uh, my own YouTube video? All right, so let's get down to business. All right, and I'll start with start with this one. That's a uh, EVGA Intelligent Innovation EG Force 8800 GT. I'm not really a gamer, so I don't know much about these, what they do or how old they are. I can tell you one thing, I see a lot of MLCCs on these. Now, there's a lot of controversy about what's actually in MLCCs. Some people say they're not worth it. Some say the older ones, the non-magnetic ones, have a lot of value to them. I don't know. E-Waste Ben says he keeps them anyway. So I'm just going to trust E-Waste Ben on that. There was one guy who has a popular video of him processing some MLCCs. I don't know. Throughout the entire video, keep saying oh this is the first time I've ever done this I've never done this before I don't know what I don't know what to expect because I've never done this he says it he says it or implies it throughout the entire video oh that's that's a nice looking processor there I guess they would have to be so, uh, something about yeah just something about that video just uh, it didn't I was the first time I watched it the guy's demeanor just didn't seem right to me so I don't know how much and he basically came up with the conclusion that they weren't worth keeping so I don't know it just seemed like he had an agenda through the whole video I'm not sure what it was and I'm not going to judge him but I'm kind of discounting that I ever saw that video anyway that is what the GPU is I'm assuming most people call the whole cards GPUs, but it's actually referring to the processor itself. I think these are integrated circuits, but I don't know enough about these. There's a big ML MLCC there. Those pins look like they got at least a little bit of uh, gold plating. Of course, these will have some gold plating. The S-Video card. I've seen some nice pins on uh, S-Video cards. So I'll definitely be uh, keeping that one. There's a gold-plated crystal. That's probably a crystal oscillator. Looks like it's got the four pins. Okay. And the rest of this just looks like a fan assembly. I'll take it apart anyway. Driver is too big. And that doesn't seem to be doing it either. Really? Now I'm just curious. I think I'm just gonna stop obsessing about this and move on. Alright, I think I'm just gonna take the the rest of these apart and show you what I get. 
This is a GeForce GTX 260. So I'm assuming these are, this is older. This isn't marked, so I don't know what it is. All right, I'm back. Got these apart. Um, this is the one that wasn't marked. It ended up being an NVIDIA. I don't know, there's a label here. There we go. But yeah, same story. Nice processor. This probably looks like it's the oldest of them all, so it's looks like it's got the biggest one there. Um, same suspects as before, you know, lots of MLCCs, connectors, and always the gold fingers, which I didn't mention before. So, in a minute I'll pull some of these, uh, processors, uh, in a minute I'll pull some of these processors off to take a look at them. But this last one is different from those, but it just had this on it. It's also in it, uh, some kind of NVIDIA. There's the label on that. <clears throat> but it's got a processor there. Connectors, gold fingers, crystal, silver crystal, blah, blah, blah. Ah, all these tiny little specks are silver solder. That's nice, but it's a, <laughs> it's a pain in the ass to keep as much of it as possible. It just goes everywhere. See what we got. Yep, silver solder under there too. That guy's nice. I have no idea how much uh, gold is in there, but it's got nice silver solder. Yeah, I guess that's pretty much all you need to see of that. The rest of them are pretty much the same. 